Hey everyone, it's Kevin here. And today I'm on location at my storage unit. It's been such a great thing for me to implement that helps my workflow, helps my sanity, and uh, just a lot of things. So I don't know about you guys, but starting out, I would have all of my DJ equipment all over the house, okay? In the basement, in uh, in my office, or in my you know room designated for gear and other things. And it just really was hard on the family, right? Like I had stuff cluttered everywhere. It was hard to find stuff and I would forget things too sometimes. So um, I knew that that was not a long-term solution. And uh, what I did was invested and started using a storage unit down the street. And this is just a, a public storage. Uh, so if you have a public storage in your neighborhood, it's pretty reasonable. I'll show you guys what uh, inside of mine and how much I pay and everything for it uh, here in the uh, the greater Cincinnati, Ohio market. But um, I really love it. It's been great. Uh, this one, in fact, is a secure location. There's a gate all around the premises, and you know you have to put in a code to actually come into the into the site. And uh, the unit that I chose is a, um, and I'll take you in here. It's basically a climate controlled, which means uh, temperature and humidity controlled unit, which is really great because what I don't want to do, of course, with those sensitive electronics, like speakers, controllers, and those kind of things, mixers, everything that we use as mobile DJs, I don't want any of that getting uh, too humid, right? You don't want humidity around any kind of electronics. That's a, a big problem of course right so i'm going to take you inside here a pro tip would be to try to get a unit on the first floor so i'm right here i've got parking right out here and in fact when there's no one around i can kind of just pull up right front right up front and uh and be right in front of the door uh, i love this this facility because there's always like a cart here and it's kind of a shared cart that everybody can use but it's been great of course to wheel everything out and I don't have to break out the rock and roller or whatever. So I'm just gonna take you guys down here and I'm just going to unlock it here. All right, so this is a 15 by five unit, okay? And you can probably see here that uh, it's, it's packed full. Not too full though, there's definitely some space. You can see that it's not as deep. It's not very deep. So that's that five foot deep. I love this configuration because everything's very visible to me and accessible quickly. So I can come in here, I can get what I need for my gig or my event and I can go and it keeps me very organized. What I did was I put in a little shelf unit just for things as you can see like um, bags or boxes or things that kind of uh, tend to get lost or misplaced uh, if you kind of just pile them in a corner. So this is great. Some gaff tape, uh, some spray paint, some boxes and things. Uh, and lesser use stuff on top. And then I kind of have, it's there's some method, some organization to the madness. Like I have my ceremony stuff over here. I have lighting here. And then uh, most of my speakers and such here. And you can kind of see it's a big... It's a big uh, pile, but what's great is all my most used gear, speaker stands and, and my SRX tops here that I use mostly, they're all right here, super accessible for me. I love this unit, um, uh, again, because of the way that it keeps me organized, but because I can keep everything in its own little section, that's really good because, um, you know, at the house, I would have something upstairs, something in the basement, whatever. Maybe you left something in the car. Again, this helps me stay organized. Now, uh, some of you might have a trailer that can be a great way to organize. What I found here, what I love about this versus a trailer, at least in my market, I've got the humidity control here in this, in this facility, and I'm not going to get any problems like I might get if I had a trailer. So that's it, guys. Just a quick look into my storage unit and uh, I just wanted to show you guys because some of you who might be dealing with keeping everything at home and uh, and you don't really and you don't feel like that's the best workflow for you uh, this storage unit becomes an awesome solution and uh, for a 15 by 5 unit like this I pay about $42 a month 
here in the Cincinnati, Ohio market. And so that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. Take care.